Hey everybody, it's it's here, the dog jog and 5k run for the SPCA, the Bergs Run Disney, are running for the dogs, and we're headed to the SPCA in downtown Richmond. We had some sprinkles on the windshield when we started off, but we decided to head that way anyways. And on the way there, we had pretty good weather and bright blue skies. But as we're getting off the highway, we're starting to see some ominous clouds over here on the right hand side. And as we were headed toward the stoplight up here, we started to get some sprinkles on the windshield. See those clouds over there on the right? Not looking too good, but we're turning left. So we headed to the SPCA. We pulled out the schedule of events. Hi everybody. And we see on the weather that it's supposed to rain for the entire length of the race. So I jumped out of the car and took some video of the sky and saw where it went from sunny to very dark and ominous and stormy looking. And you'll see here in a second, I'm not the only one that decided, nope, we're not staying for the race, not running in the rain. So we decided to go home, we'll run it tomorrow. But on the way home, the skies turned blue and we decided when we got home, we'll just run the race in our neighborhood. So we put our sunglasses on because it is bright out and we decided to just run this 5K in our neighborhood. So we are now headed out, we've just started. It's beautiful. Our neighborhood's really pretty in the springtime. You can see we have some neighbors that have hammocks out already. We have flowers blooming, trees blooming. We have lawns that are turning very pretty green. However, it's chilly out. When you're not in the sun, it is cold. The wind is brutal. So we were in a hurry to get back in the sunshine. We live behind a school, not many people were out today. It's still quite chilly this morning. This is my favorite little house. Their yard is always impeccable. But that sky, oh my goodness, hard to believe that 30 minutes ago, it looked like the bottom was gonna fall out. Look, another walker and his doggy. But over here on the left are remnants of the rain, stagnant water, and oh, it smelled awful. But it did make some pretty flowers. Oh, a little lending library. The people that live in this house did just sell their house, so I don't know if that little lending library will stay, but that is kind of cute. We caught up to the dog. More blooming trees. Fake blooms. And this is Jeffrey. And up the street here, there is a special needs child and the neighbors all put um, very brightly colored bird houses on, on the trees and it looks really neat. See, they're across the street from each other. How cool is that? 
Oh, I'm going to slow the video down here. We have a family of white squirrels. If you look real close. Not a cloud in the sky. Imagine that. motorized skateboard here on the right. I thought they outlawed those. Hmm, I could sure use one right now. And as we were getting toward the end of our walk, we started seeing more people out. I guess it was getting warmer out. Oh, what a neat perspective. I wonder if M knew that he still had the camera on when he turned it downward. Hmm. About this point, my foot had completely fallen asleep. Evidently, I had my shoe tied too tight. So about here, we are about finished with our 3.1 miles. That was 5K with the Bergs Run Disney in less than 8 minutes. Not really. It took us 56 minutes. But there you have it. The Bergs Run Disney. We run for the dogs this week.